In this segment for your life, we've gone on a little bit of an excursion and we've ended up all the way here in Idabel, Oklahoma and we're at the Museum of the Red River and I'm here with my friend Brian Hendershot. Brian, thanks so much for inviting us out. Yeah, not a problem. Happy to have you. Yeah, so this place is incredible. You have to come, come here to see it to really believe what you guys have done with the place. So let me get this straight. It started as like a one tiny building and it has grown to what it is now. Right, yeah. When the museum first opened in uh, 1974, we were just over 2,000 square feet total. And after the construction is finished here in a month or two, we'll be over 55,000 square feet. Wow, that's insane. So yeah. you guys have made incredible process over the years. Mm -hmm. So tell me a little bit about what we can see here at the Museum of the Red River. Sure. Well, first and foremost, you can see the Oklahoma State Dinosaur, which is behind us. Yes. Um, Acocanthosaurus, or Acro for short. Uh, but we are first and foremost an ethnographic art museum. Um, and we actually house one of the nation's foremost collections of ethnographic art. So what I mean by that is art made by indigenous people uh, you know, from the Americas, uh, parts of Asia and Africa, wow. basically. That's insane. Yeah. So how many exhibits do you have here in total? Um, it depends on how you classify it, I guess. <laughs> um, about seven or eight at any one time, um, but we usually have one main exhibit okay. that rotates about every three months and the other sort of rotate, maybe, mm -hmm. maybe not, depends on what's going on. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about information about visiting the museum. How much does it cost to visit and what are your hours? Uh, it's totally free. Uh, the museum is open uh, Tuesday through Saturday from 10 a.m. to uh, 5 p.m. and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Awesome. So we wanted to go into detail a little bit about the exhibits that you have and the and the things that people might be able to see. Mm -hmm. So there's a dinosaur behind us, but walk me through the museum and some of the things that we're going to be able to see here. Sure. So our two big exhibits that we have up right now. First um, is a Native American Cradle exhibit, which is exactly what it sounds like. Uh, we actually have probably one of the best collections of Native American Cradles in the United States, mm -hmm. certainly in the, in the state of Oklahoma. So that's really cool. Um, and then we also just added another gallery space called the Founders Gallery. And the stuff in there rotates basically um, it is a collection of what we consider to be the best items in our collection. Okay. Um, and each piece is just really a definitive piece. So there's, you know, definitive African pieces, definitive Native American pieces, definitive East Asian pieces. Really cool. Yeah. So lots of culture right here inside mm -hmm. the museum. Mm -hmm. And tell me, if a family wants to come out, is this place kid friendly? We want to invite families to come out and visit you guys. Oh yeah, most definitely. We actually have a dedicated space where families can take their kids and it's got a hands-on learning activities that are related to either our exhibits or um, to our collections. And that's open every day except for Sunday and that's manned by a staff person. Awesome. So there's a lot to learn here at Museum mm -hmm. of the Red River and a lot of the, the exhibits will have an explanation. You can learn a lot and it's really not just an engaging activity but something that will leave you with a lot of knowledge to take home. So remind us again where you're located. Where can we visit the Museum of the Red River? We're located at 812 East Lincoln Road in Idabel, Oklahoma. Awesome. Thank you, Brian, for inviting us out. We're going to go check out the Museum of the Red River. We want to invite you to come and check it out. There's a lot of history, a lot of great, fun information to learn here. So we're going to invite you out to visit the Museum of the Red River right here in Attleville, Oklahoma.